What do you think it is about? Like, and, and this is a question about the award shows. You see the award shows, and it seems like uh, the, the the a lot of the performers have a very very similar political ideology. Okay, let me just say this. I'm v- I feel very strongly about this. People say on Twitter, oh, why don't you just go back to being Hollywood? Why don't you just go and just act and, and don't get political? We are Americans first. Then we are man and woman. Then we are whatever religion we are. And then we are professional. But we are Americans first. We think American. We feel for our country. And we have every right to be thoughtful about what is affecting us also. So that bullshit about go back and be Hollywood, go back and just be an actor, is the stupidest thing I have ever heard. Right, right. What I was, what I was asking at the award show is not why do they express the opinions, but why, why is, do you think it is that th- there's really one ideology that is like 90% of Hollywood? Do you know, in order to create art, you must come from an emotional place first. It is, um, uh, as an actor, you've got to be on top of your emotionality in order to convince other people to come with you into the story. Not with the story, but go bring them into the story. We are emotional beings. Dancers are emotional. Painters are emotional. Writers, for the most part, of fiction are emotional. And, you know, when you are emotional and you're looking at the well-being of our entirety, of our country, of the country we were born in and love, you're going to have an ideology that probably is more humane. Do you think, though, that sometimes the way Hollywood comes across, and I say Hollywood with with that exact you know mentality because it is sort of, aside from a select few, the one viewpoint, a lot of times it comes across as, as it's almost like a moral high ground. Like, since they're coming from this place where emotionally they feel like what they're doing is, you know a, what? is good versus evil. No, that... no, I will tell you that you just, you know, you weed it out just the way that in every profession there are people you listen to and people who are assholes, people you listen to and people who don't know what they're talking about. When Meryl Streep gave her speech, she was completely engaged from her being and meant what she was saying. Instead of going, oh, yeah, we're right and you're wrong. Everybody's got an opinion, but we've got ours. People have got theirs, and I respect that. Yeah. Uh, on my side, on their side, it doesn't matter. Yeah. I'm, I want to hear. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I will learn. Maybe I can take a, um, something that I hear from uh, an opposition point of view and uh, enrich my life with it. See, that's fair. Like, but it, it's, see, people today just keep trying to shut down opinions. That's right. Like. That's what we're doing yes. in America now. It's crazy. We came here. We, this country was built on the idea of being able to be who you are. Right. 